Hi, my name is Kai Armstrong, and I'm the principal PM for Code Review here at GitLab. And I wanted to show off the latest experiment we have for using AI inside of the merge request. So let me go ahead and share my screen here. This one. So this is a merge request. Um, you can, it's pretty simple. There's no comments or no activity on it currently. You can look at the changes. It just adds um, some new functions here. Um, and you can see. And so what we want to go ahead and do is we want to ask, um, do a code review to go ahead and review that. And so the way this works today is you type a quick action in here. So you'll be able to type duo underscore code underscore review. And then this will ask um, the GitLab code review bot to go ahead and review this merge request. So I'll comment this. You can see the duo code reviewer lets you know that it's starting your review. Um, there's also options to rate the review and leave feedback. So um, once you've experienced a review, if you've got feedback about it, you can rate it or you can go ahead and leave the feedback. You can also just see this comments updated now. So what that means is that the review has been completed. So once the review completes, um, the Duo Code Reviewer tells you sort of like what it's found, kinds of issues that it's found and other things like that. And if you scroll down, you can see each of the comments that it's left. So it's um, telling us... Um, that it wants us to add, but that sees an undefined variable. Um, and so we should, you know, remove it or, you know, fix that in some other way, but it's making some assumptions based on what it's seeing in the functions here. Um, and that goes through for sort of everything in the file uh, that we've got here. And so all of these comments are designed to be sort of actionable things that you can do um, to improve the merge request uh, and use this as a level of review. So, um, you know, you might use this after you finish drafting your MR to review it as a first round of review and then improve that. And then you pass it to a maintainer. Um, you might use this to, if you're going to review an MR, to go ahead and review it and sort of give you a head start on a review. So these are the ways we're thinking about this. Um, we're interested in your feedback here in terms of like, are the comments accurate? Are they actionable? Do you like the interactions Um in the comments? Do you um, like the quick action, other things like that? What other ways are you thinking about using it and all of those kinds of things? So if you have feedback, again, rate the review, leave feedback for us. Um, we're really excited about this as a sort of first pass on how we might do code review in the MR. Um, so let us know what you think. Thanks.